Hmm, Zika virus is a worrying thing, my dearies. But don't you worry, because I'm here to tell you all about it, so that you stay safe and healthy. Come, what are you waiting for, huh? Zoom in! The Zika virus disease was first identified in 1947 in rhesus monkeys in Uganda. And then it was subsequently identified in humans as well. And now it has spread all over in Africa, America, Asia and the Pacific. This virus is transmitted to people through the bite of an infected mosquito. This could be the same mosquito that transmits dengue, chikungunya and yellow fever. The early symptoms of this disease are fever, skin rashes, conjunctivitis, muscle pain, joint pain and headache, which are usually mild and last for two to seven days. Well, now comes the serious part. Do you know that the Zika virus also causes the much dreaded disease called microcephaly? Never heard of that before, right? Don't you worry, I'll tell you. Microcephaly is a condition where the baby's head is much smaller than expected, which can later lead to complications such as dwarfism, seizures, delayed speech and movements. If a mother is infected with the Zika virus during a pregnancy, her baby is likely to be born with microcephaly. And that could be quite dangerous. But hey, don't you worry because all you need to do is keep your surroundings free of mosquitoes. Wear long sleeve shirts and long pants to stay away from mosquito bites. As we all know that prevention is better than cure. Trivia time! Zika is mainly carried by a specific type of mosquito called Aedes aegypti. There is no vaccine against the Zika virus yet. But don't worry, scientists are trying their best to find one. So friends, squat the menacing mosquitoes around and stay safe. This is me zooming out. Tune in next time for more fun facts.